Welcome to our tech tutorial. Today, we're tackling a challenge that many developers encounter when working with file uploads. Our viewer is successfully uploading files to Google Cloud Storage using the at Google Cloud slash storage NPM package. However, they need to display the upload progress for larger files, specifically those over 20 megabytes. They are submitting an AJAX request with the file as form data to a Node.js REST API, which then uploads the file to Google Cloud Storage. The catch, they want to avoid direct uploads from the browser to the cloud. So how can they send back the upload progress to the UI? Let's explore this question together and find some solutions. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, I'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution you're looking for. Guys, remember to say just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully you work through to that resolution. Now, let's continue on. To track the upload progress of files to Google Cloud Storage using Node.js, we need to set up a few things. First, ensure you have the at Google Desk Cloud Storage package installed in your project. Next, let's create a function to handle the file upload. We'll use the createWriteStream method to upload the file and listen for the progress event to track the upload status. Now we need to send the upload progress back to the client. We can achieve this by using a WebSocket or server sent events to push updates to the browser. Finally, on the client side, we need to set up a WebSocket connection to receive the upload progress updates and display them in the browser. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To track file upload progress with Google Cloud Storage and Node.js, start by using XML HTTP request. This allows you to monitor the upload progress through an event listener. Next, open a socket connection to send progress messages from your event listener. This way, you can consume these messages on the client side. For more detailed guidance, check out the references provided. And that's it, guys. I hope this video has helped you get through to that resolution you're looking for. And if it did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. Now, until next time, I hope you have a good day and see you then. Cheers.